Hey friends, welcome back again. So as we know, uBlock Origin has been removed from Google Extension Store a long time ago. And a lot of people are missing the extension because it's been, in fact, really useful. So what do you do with no ad blocker? Good question. You try to get it back to life. So if we go over here and of course that only in Google, uh, because in Firefox, in fact, it's still supported and I'm using it to this moment. Let's search for it. I don't need to search for it because it's the first extension I have installed. So let's just go to Google and type extension store just like that and select this one. Over here, I will type uBlock Origin extension, not this one, uBlock origin not this one you block you block origin don't be like that ladies and gents it's officially removed from here why well good question uh i don't think this is the way we're gonna search for it we're just gonna search for it like this if we come i believe if i come to the official website and click this one and then get you block origin you will see this this extension is no longer available because it doesn't follow best practices for chrome extensions well good google for doing such a big move and finally disabling the ad blocker that's made your ad revenue way less over the year so uh okay so what we'll do today is try to get that back again to life and the way we're gonna do it is using one of those methods uh yeah it's basically um I opened those links already just to make sure they work and they actually work. So uh, those are two methods we are gonna be using in order to get uBlock Origin to work again. So what I will do is basically select in this and then I'll try to follow what this says. So the way they fixed it basically by opening the thingy over here in inspect mode and then searching for something that says disabled or enabled let me just see so in here it says disabled and you gotta and you know basically switch this to enabled but where will i find this i will just copy this and make the big brain move and search for it but how will I search for it? Don't ask me, I'm a beginner myself, but I believe this way. Paste that thing and click answer. No matches found. Good, really, really good. Okay, so um, maybe I'm missing something, you never know. So in here it says na 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 And then in here it says a lot of that, uh, the same exact thing, but where is the code? Uh, guys, uh, we might be in trouble, but that's fine. You know what? Maybe we'll move to the second method, which is by selecting two. And then, uh, none of those can I be. Okay, what if I open this? And then, okay, so this is the GitHub page for uBlock. All right, so if I go down here, I should find the download link that will basically take me to the same page but i'm now on chrome so what i will do is i will get that link and just slide it please excuse me okay what if i take this and then this then i click on a new window then i put this good okay so what i will do again is copy this link and just paste it in here okay can i so it doesn't work so how are we gonna fix this you asking me i'm trying to find a solution myself get the latest release extract the zip go to the extension page enable developer mode and select the folder and load it as an extension makes sense so i will get the zip thingy uh where is it so there's xbi folder or file there is chrome web store and there is y and there is u block x and how in the hell should i enable this if i don't even have the zip file um oh the assets oh uh i'm, I'm stupid uh so uh okay so i'll select this one you know please um don't focus on my stupidity i'm stupid most of the time but sometimes i use my brain okay so let's just try to open that i guess so the way he explained this is by um 
not here. Okay, so get the latest release, extract the zip, go to the extension page, enable developer mode. Good. So first of all, I will enable developer mode somewhere in here, uh, which should be easy. Uh, how to? Okay, so here is developer mode. Uh, at least I remember how to enable it. And then load unpacked. Good. I know how to do that by just coming over here and just extracting this here. We're good and ready to go. But why this? Okay, this is just icons. I thought it was, you know, the Firefox version, but that's fine. I'm just silly and stupid. So, yeah, what should I do? Okay, load, download. It's not in here, but in fact, it's in here. And select folder. So, I have it. Do I have it? Yes, I do. Is this working? Let's find out. If I click ads page, or, or just, you know, let's just find a page full of ads. Again, okay, not the page full of of ads uh how i don't know where will i don't know where to check ads what's the website this is full of ads is this gonna be full of ads probably so if i turn this off so it's actually working okay so guys we reached the end of our video why because basically it does work so all you have to do is get the zip file extract it then basically turn on the developer mode somewhere in here and then just load unpacked and you're good to go. So if I close this, 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 and then this, and then that, and then this, and then just this and that, you will see that we have a blank page. Uh, I will try to go to YouTube and see if it actually does work because I know you guys mostly use this for YouTube. I know. So let's just open the YouTube page and see what will happen. I will type something like Mercedes because I'm a big fan of Mercedes. And I hope I buy one soon, uh, but I'm broke. Anyways, it works. I see the number increasing, which is good and uh, convenient. Why is he broken this? What an asshole. Anyways, let's just go back to the main screen. At least now I should have some videos in here. Please? I mean, right? Funny videos? Come on, try to show up something in the main screen. For God's sake. Now if I click on here. Why? Why? I just want to see if it's, I don't want to click on any video because uh, I don't want to get a copyright strike or something like that. But please, can you just like, you know, do something? Okay, let's just watch shorts for a little bit. No, 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 no. That's not what I meant. Uh, can I go here and see something? No. Okay, what if I close the YouTube websites and then reopen it once again? What will I see? Okay, so we got some videos. Really, really good. Now... Is there is any ads? Nope. There is no ads, ladies and gents. So uh, let's just go a bit down and see. Usually the ads show up somewhere in the left or the right in a line of videos. So there should be an ad somewhere in here. And if I come over here and then turn off this and reload, I will see ads for sure. So where are the ads? I'm waiting. Where is the ads? YouTube, are you tricking me? YouTube is tricking me, guys. This is not funny, YouTube. I don't want to open a video. I will get immediately a strike. Okay, so this is bad. How do I know if ads are enabled or disabled? Well, this increased the numbers every time I load YouTube. Look at that. Okay, so blocked on this page, 12. Can you add more when I'm scrolling? Yes. It does. Okay, can you add? Okay, it actually does. 25, 29, 33. Okay, keep keep doing it. You're doing good. You block, come on. But the number stopped at... Okay, so we got 43. So this, in fact, works just fine. And if I click on a video, I will risk it. Even if I should not do so, I will just uh, see if there is any copyrights free videos. Copyright free videos. They will have ads for sure. Uh huh. You see 107. So, guys, we fixed it. I hope you enjoyed that video and uh, I hope that video was actually helpful for you. If it did help you, it gets you block or general work in again. Please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more content. And see you guys in the next one.